Hey guys, the objective for this video is to use the similarity laws for pumps. So we have a centrifugal pump which has an impeller diameter of 1 meter and is to be constructed so that it will supply a head rise of 200 meters at a flow rate of 4.1 meters cubed per second of water when operating at a speed of 1200 rpm. To set the characteristics of a pump, a 1 in 5 scale geometrically similar model operated at the same speed as to be tested in the laboratory. So what we need to do is determine the required model discharge and head rise and assume that both the model and the prototype operate with the same efficiency. So the first thing we need to do is work out what that model discharge needs to be and to do that we're going to use the fact that they have the same flow coefficient. So that means that um, our flow rate divided by our angular velocity divided by our diameter cubed for the model has to be equal to our flow rate divided by our angular velocity divided by our diameter cubed for the prototype. So we can then rearrange this to make our flow rate for the model the subject. So the flow rate of the model is going to be equal to the angular velocity of the model divided by the angular velocity of the prototype multiplied by the diameter of the model divided by the diameter of the prototype all to the power of a 3 multiplied by the flow rate of the prototype.